week after Hurricane Matthew brought high winds and heavy rain, many communities are still dealing with flooding. Even worse, some are expecting a new round of flooding today. One of them is Kinston in Lenore County. It's near the Noose River, which goes right through that area, and it is still rising this morning. CBS North Carolina's Lauren Havlin is there right now with an update on the conditions. She's also there with the mayor. The Noose River has already reached record levels. That's beating the levels during Hurricane Floyd in 1999, which many of you remember, and it is still rising, expecting to crest later tonight. Like you said, I'm here with the mayor of Kinston, B.J. Murphy. What are your thoughts when you just look at all of this? The, the, the devastation is certainly incredible. Th thankfully for us, the worst devastation we ever experienced was Floyd 17 years ago. So this is really bad, but we're so thankful we went through something already. So this community knows how to prepare, we know how to get together, we know how to save lives, and we just want to make sure that any loss of life going forward is not because of um, inappropriate decisions like going around a barricade or do, doing something silly like jumping in this water. Now, it's not over yet, no. so how, what do you want residents to know that maybe haven't left the area? Well, first, we, we just want them out. We've been knocking on doors for four or five days. I told some folks I felt like Noah this week. I'd be just warning everybody, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming, and here it is, going to be up to 29 feet today, which is record setting, and we just need to make sure that those in low-lying areas throughout the counties, throughout the Noose River areas, to get out now. Uh, special thanks to our fire, police, and emergency services folks. They've been absolute uh, professionals. Love seeing the National Guard and Coast and those folks here, but we don't want to use them. So we want the people, we want to knock on your door today and not bring a boat tomorrow. Yesterday, the governor was here serving the damage that's already been done. He said it's going to take months for people, maybe even years, to recover from this. Absolutely. The good thing for the state is that we've got this emergency uh, fund. So short term, we know we're going to be okay. FEMA's already coming in. But the loss of revenue for our businesses, our business community, for individuals being able to just, you know, pay their own bills, I mean, that, 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 that will be a struggle for our communities for some time now. So hopefully we'll be able to cover faster than the last one last major disaster 20 years ago, uh, but certainly it will have a short-term and a long-term impact on us economically. Absolutely. Thank you so much, mm -hmm. Mayor. Again, we are here in Kinston where mo officials are closely monitoring the Noose River, expected to crest around 29 feet later on tonight. Live in Kinston, Lauren Hablett, CBS, North Carolina.